In today's video, I will teach you how to use intelligent scissors in GIMP. Let's get started. GIMP provides intelligent scissors tool aiming to simplify the selection process by intelligently tracing the edges of an object in an image. Despite its potential, the tool can be challenging to use effectively. Now here's a step-by-step -step guide on how to use the intelligent scissors tool in GIMP. First, switch to the scissor select tool using the toolbox or simply use the shortcut key I for a quick tool switch. Now, enable the interactive boundary option in the tool options panel for a more intuitive selection process. Click to set the first point on your object's boundary. Click again for the second point, and the tool will intelligently position the boundary line between them. Alternatively, click and drag to preview the tool's placement, then hold shift to force placement. Use the backspace key to remove the last point and the escape key to cancel the entire selection. Now we're going to polish your selection. First, Reposition existing points by hovering over them with a move cursor. And to add a new anchor point, hover over a boundary line segment. You can also remove an anchor point by holding down the shift key or command key and click on it. Make sure that your scissors boundary is a closed shape to successfully convert it into a selection boundary. And once you're satisfied with your selection, press enter. GIMP will convert the intelligent scissors boundary into a standard selection marquee and the selection becomes active. Despite its challenges, the tool can be useful with practice. If you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.